Great. It's wonderful to be here. It's just, this is obviously tall for him. Uh, but I'm feeling great, and um, I know that we are live streaming for the first time. This is a new thing for CRC. We're live streaming. I'm just going to do this. This is very strange. Um, we're live streaming, but we also have um, our students as part of our audience tonight. So, hey, I don't know if they can hear you or not, but make some noise out there. Hey. Um, this is, <laughs> it's really great. It's a lot of fun to finally be making music in person. Have yeah. you, did you get a chance to do any music in person when you started here with us? Yes, I've okay. one, one semester only, so it's been two years to the day, really. So we're excited. So welcome back to Professor Kiesner to the stage. It's pretty exciting to have you back, and I'm so happy to have our singers back here. Clearly, we're not wearing masks. That's the thing. It's a special thing we can do for performances only. They're wearing masks out there. You can't see that uh, out in La La Land. But um, it is wonderful to be uh, here and to finally hear some live music. So uh, yeah, what are we going to hear tonight? All right. Well, we're going to start off with the jazz band. And the jazz band is a jazz combo. And you can see the individuals here. You have a virtual program that you can check out. But I will announce the members of the group and the tunes that we play throughout the set. So I'm um, really excited to present this really talented, energetic group of musicians to you. Um, and we'll first play All Blues. Thank you. 
Thank you so much, everyone. All blues. All blues. All right, we're going to continue with another tune from that same record. If you know what that is, I've got a dollar for you after the show. Doesn't mean much these days, I suppose. <laughs> okay, six bucks, one gallon of gas, all right? <laughs> or seven if you ride a diesel. So uh, <laughs> I'd like to introduce you to the band Danny Garland on guitar. Aaron Greenfield on tenor saxophone. <laughs> Nate Jackson on trumpet. Chris Coford on bass and drums. Andrew Martinez on alto saxophone. Ricky Roldan on trombone and bass. And Edson Seichow on flute. Okay, and now another tune from that same record. You know what it is? Freddy Freeloader. Here we go.
Thank you so much. Both of those tunes from Kind of Blue. Yeah, Kind of Blue. <laughs> oh, wait, lovely. We have two more tunes, and um, we are going to play St. James Infirmary. It's a tune we've really been enjoying playing, and uh, I hope we can do something fun and different. <laughs> Every time we play this, it's always an adventure and always new. So St. James Infirmary. <laughs> Thank you. 
Thank you. Thank you so much, everyone. Our last piece is uh, Eddie Harris's Cold Duck Time. This is going to feature everyone. And um, yeah, we've really enjoyed performing, of course, and rehearsing and seeing one another again. It just uh, is a real testament to the dynamic nature of what we do in music and that it can't really uh, be replicated in a virtual environment. So this is so important that we do this. And i um, really happy that you could join us here live and, of course, in the live stream. So Cold Duck Time, here we go.
so much the CRC Jazz Band. Be back next with our choirs. Hello, and um, that was awesome. Uh, I'm so, so excited to be back in this space and uh, to hearing the live music as we mentioned, but that was really extraordinary. Let's give another big round of applause to Jazz, who really set us off for a wonderful, great concert. Yes, yes, yes. It's really, really great. Um, and it's so nice to share the concert. We don't usually get a chance to do that, to share the concert with the instrumentalists. Um, I'm Omari Tal, professor of vocal music here at CRC, and uh, we combined our efforts to uh, have a, a decent sized chorus this semester. So we've got a little bit of college chorus, little chamber singers, some partly uh, auditioned kind of voices, and then we've got some, just everybody who wanted to sing, we put together. We do have another choir, gospel choir, which is actually gonna start next semester in its uh, second eight week session. But it, it is just fun to put our voices together, something that has been very difficult to do, again, uh, in the squares of the Zoom virtual sort of setting. Uh, so we really jumped at the chance to sing together and we've been practicing in our masks and so finally at performance time we can take them off and really let our voices go. So we've got something totally different for you this evening. We are, uh, we've been exploring madrigals and rounds from like the 1600s, early, early music. Um, and, but we played with them a little bit and sort of gave them a new life and sort of arranged them ourselves. So we've got some singers who will be playing some instruments as well. We're going to start off with a round called New Oysters. New Oysters. And you'll find that there's a theme tonight. And everything um, has animals of some sort in it. So New Oysters. New Oysters at a groat a peck. At a groat a peck, each uh, new whale fleet oysters. Each oyster worth two pence. 
Fetch us bread and wine that we may eat. Let us lose no time with such good meat, a banquet for a prince. I don't know about you, but I love oysters. <laughs> Next up, El Grillo, a cricket. The cricket is a fine singer who can hold a long note. Sing, cricket, about carousels. The cricket is a fine singer, but he is not like other birds. As soon as they have sung a little while, they are off on business elsewhere. But the cricket always stays put when the weather is at its hottest. Then he sings only for love. Oh, 
As I me walked in a May morning, I heard a bird sing cuckoo.
That was another 1600 uh, round uh, from a book called uh, Pamelia, full of rounds from the 1600s by Thomas Ravenscroft. And so we had a blast working with all of these lovely, multi-talented performers who sing and play instruments. You saw them, you know them. There's so many of you in this room right now. And so we're so impressed that we can have fun and do more than just sing around. So instead, we uh, had fun opening that up. Um, that was Lady, Come Down and See the Cat Sits in the Plum Tree. So we had cats and other animals. We've got a lot of animals in this next piece. It's called Contrapunto Bestiale alla Mente. The animals improvise some counterpoint. <laughs> the text, fa la la, woof woof woof, woof. <laughs> meow, hoo, cuckoo. And of course the bass is in a, another language will sing. A hunchback is really not very <coughs> trustworthy. Um, and a braggart, if they're good, put that down in the history books. This is Contrapunto Bestiale Nego As he lay in his dena, huffa, trolilo, just nonsense words. As he lay in his dena, buffa, trolilo, as he lay in his dena. The dog is just laying around having a good time. And so, shall we?
so very much to our instrumentalists here. Thank you, thank you so very much. We really appreciate it. Please hang around. Uh, for those of you at home, go grab a little juice and a cracker or something like that. We'll be right back with Concert Band. Thank you so much for being with us tonight.
All right, welcome back, and thank you so much for joining us again. And what an amazing set of music from the choir. Amazing job. <laughs> makes me just want to have them put their instruments down and do something with their mouths, you know what I mean? Just makes them, I mean, that was so fun, and how creative. Um, and so we try to do stuff like this, as, as creative as that, as, we, as much as we can in this ensemble. And so um, what you see here are students from the concert band, MUP 330, and orchestra, 310, MUP 310. And um, so what we like to do in this ensemble is we like to do two things, basically. We feature student ensembles, uh, uh, sorry, uh, student arrangements and compositions. And then this semester, we've chosen to take on the genre of tango music. And I'll explain a little bit more about that when we get to that particular uh, little set. But our opener for today is an arrangement of the Gusty Garden theme arranged by Armando Muse. So I believe this is from Super Mario Brothers? Yeah, OK, right, <laughs> Super Mario Brothers. All right, we really hope you enjoy Armando's arrangement of Gusty Garden Galaxy.
Armando Muse, Armando Muse, the arranger. Okay, we're gonna follow that with another student arrangement. Um, this is Ray's theme from Star Wars The Force Awakens, and this was written and arranged by Evan French. That's Evan French again on the arrangement of Ray's theme. So our final student arrangement is um, called An Exploration of Themes. It's the Bach Cello Suite Number no. 2, and it's taken from The Prelude. And this one is done by Glenn Lewis. Thank you. 
Glenn Lewis on the arrangement. Glenn Lewis on the arrangement. So excited to play um, student arrangements. It's really, I think, the best thing that we do. <laughs> um, we have plenty of music to choose from, of course. The whole history of concert band and orchestra repertoire is available to us, but it's so much better if, if you write things for us. <laughs> so keep writing. Um, all right, so let's introduce the band really quickly. Um, Hasna Alakosai on piano. <laughs> Zara Barsadi on violin. <laughs> Glenn Lewis on bass trombone and arrangements. <laughs> Ricky Roldan on trombone. <laughs> Selena Delgadillo on French horn. Lynn Fowler on oboe. You already met Evan French on mallet percussion and arrangements. Nate Jackson on trumpet. Mia Kawakami on clarinet. Andrew Martinez on alto saxophone. You also met Armando Muse on trumpet. <laughs> Ruben Rampin on tenor saxophone. <laughs> and Wen Ying Wu on hammered dulcimer. <laughs> okay, great. So um, now we'd like to feature two tangos. And um, tango is a lot like jazz in some respects, where everyone just gets one sheet. They get the melody and they get the chord progressions. And so this has been a real interesting challenge for us because um, I, I would suppose, and maybe this is true, that many of you haven't seen chord progressions or had to improvise harmonies and create arrangements as improvising jazz musicians might. But this is very true to the tradition of tango music. If you were a musician in Buenos Aires playing in a tango ensemble, you would know the melody, you would know the chord progression, and you would improvise harmonies to the melody um, and take solos and things like this. Maybe not in the same way that we would in a jazz band, but we've been working through those concepts of looking at a melody and understanding how to harmonize something like this and creating unique arrangements to our ensemble given the form of the tune. And so um, I think and I hope this has been an interesting challenge um, for all of us, even to myself. It's something I've always wanted to um, investigate with an ensemble. And so this is kind of a cool living experimentation lab that we have, right? And so we'll continue um, trying to investigate this ensemble, or sorry, this uh, genre throughout the semester. We have two tangos for you. The first one is Nueve Puntos by Francisco Canaro, and the last one we'll play is called El Amanecer by Roberto Firpo. Thank you. 
Thank you. Nueve puntos. And our last one, El Amanecer, it's kind of like um, the daybreak, the dawn. And uh, in the original recordings, there are these sounds of birds chirping. So maybe the choir members can help us out with this. As we play, you're supposed to go, <laughs> right? Chirping birds and yeah, like this. OK, so <laughs> we weren't courageous enough to do it ourselves. So we'll enlist you. Um, and just imagine waking up beautiful spring morning in Buenos Aires, right? This is the, the setting of this tune. Um, but before the tune properly begins, we have this little introduction that we've arranged for it, and it comes from this really classic Dizzy Gillespie recording. And it just kind of fit with the tune. It has nothing to do with tango whatsoever, but it just seemed to make sense, so we did it. <laughs> but um, anyway, we really, uh, we're happy to uh, play for you tonight, so we hope you enjoy El Amanecer. And thank you to all the students for putting in all their hard work and effort this semester. CRC Concert Band and Orchestra, thank you so much. We're happy to be performing live for you, and we'll see you next time here in the theater. Uh, we do have a CRC Music in the Studio event next Friday, so catch you then online. Take care. Thank you. Good night.